Well, what the heck is this? An early morning beer review? I never do early morning beer reviews, but today I'm going to damn well do it. <laughs> Let's check it out. Hey everybody, welcome to this early morning edition of Shane's Craft Beer Review. Um, it is currently 6.30 in the morning. Um, I just got home from work, as you can tell by the ridiculous shirt. And uh, yeah, I need a beer. <laughs> God, what an awful night at work. Anyway, um, I'm going to get to uh, another beer that my buddy Dave from Dave's TV sent me. This guy right here. That's right, you guys know Dave. If you're not subscribed, please go check him out. Um, I think this is the last one uh, of the ones that he sent me. Um, if it's not, I might have one more, but I think this might be the last one that I've got in the fridge. So from the Three Floyds Brewing, this is the Zombie Ice Undead Double Pale Ale. Ooh, sounds scary. Uh, crafted with an unholy amount of citra hops, this Double Undead Pale, A pale Ale heralds the zombie evolution after the dust has settled from the apocalypse. All right, sounds good. Uh, fantastic can art on this. I love it. I'm going to put a picture of it actually over here somewhere, I think, uh, if I can find a picture. Um, it was actually so cool. When I uh, first got these, I had them lined up, and I took a picture, and I think I put them on Facebook or something like that. And one of my friends said, uh, oh, I want that can when you're done. <laughs> um, it depends. If this beer is really, really good, you're not getting the can. Sorry. But we'll see. All right, so let's get this into my Alchemist Brewery glass which is an absolutely fantastic brewery. Oh my God, I can smell this already. I'm just getting, poof, it's just, just, a, just a big waft of hops coming over. Oh, I think I'm gonna enjoy this, thank you, Dave. Dave has not sent me a bad beer. All the beers that Dave has sent me from Florida have been absolutely amazing. Um, I really need to make, maybe make a special trip down to see Dave this winter when it gets a little bit too cold up here for me. Uh, maybe I'll go down there and say hi for a couple days, maybe spend a weekend or something and uh, yeah, enjoy some Florida beers in the warm, warm sunshine and some fantastic company with Dave from Dave's TV. All right, let's take a look at this here, guys. It's got a bit of a haze to it. Love the color of this, that looks fantastic. Huge, huge, massive head on this. Get a quick little nose. Yeah, just, oh, citra hop galore, man. You can definitely smell the citra hops. And it's more, not so, not so much, a, I don't want to say it's not so much a citrusy smell, because there is a citrusy smell in there. But to me, it's almost like a, if you had like raw citra hops um, in your hand and smelt them, that's what this smells like. And as you get, some of you guys know, I, I do brew my own beer. I, and I do use citra hops in some of my beers, and that's exactly what it smells like. It smells like a handful of citra hops. It smells really fantastic. I love it. All right, let's get into the taste here. Cheers, guys. And Dave, thank you once again. Ooh. Ooh, I like what they did there. I like what they did there. Mm -mm -mm. Where's my towel? I don't have my towel there. All right. Whatever. This is going in the wash in a second anyway. As soon as I'm this beer review, I'm going to get changed and go to freaking bed. Anyway, nice and smooth. This one's actually really, really smooth. You're definitely getting that citrus from the citra hops. Really nice. Tasty as hell. It's got a bit of a creaminess to it. But just the flavor of those citra hops is really nice. It's not so, again, it's not, it's not a big citrus flavor as per se. There is some citrus in there. But it's that citra hop flavor that's just really setting this off. God, this is good. Really good. Oh, sorry. Did I mention this is 8.5% alcohol by volume? 55 IBU? I don't think I did. But there it is. There's your info right there. Man, and this is a small can too. It's only a 12 fluid ounces, which is 355 mil here in Canada. Wow, really good. I could sit, I could pound a whole bunch of these back all day. This is fantastic. So good. There's a ever so little bit of sweetness in there, which is really well balanced by the hops coming through there. Fantastic beer. God. 
I think I've only ever had one or two from Three Floyds before. Um, well, before Dave said, did, I, did he send me another one from Three Floyds? He might have. Um, but previously before that, I think I've only had one, maybe two. Uh, maybe on a time I've been to Buffalo or something like that. Really fantastic beer, guys. If you get a chance, pick up the Zombie Ice from Three Floyds. It is really good. Because I'm going to give this... Four and a half. It is really good. I really like this one. And this one actually is not from Florida as I'm sitting here looking at it. It's brewed, brewed and canned by the Three Floyds Brewing Company, Munster, Indiana. Um, maybe I didn't get this from Dave then. No, I'm pretty sure Dave sent this one. Because I don't know anybody else that lives in Indiana. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Dave sent this to me. And if he didn't, damn it, Dave, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hey, and, and if I did make a mistake and somebody else sent this to me instead of Dave, can you let me know in the comments so I don't feel like an idiot? But I'm pretty sure it was Dave that sent this to me. All right. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We will see you next time. And uh, hey, you never know. I'm probably going to do another video later on tonight. Cheers.